Someone's trying to kill Dawn. It must be Tuesday. Pretend I'm wearing a top hat this whole time, okay? I would like to preface this video by saying, yes, Jacob, I am jealous, mostly because of the very wide ramp. Jacob and I work as milfoil inspectors, which means we check boats to make sure that there isn't milfoil on them. And a lot of times people have trouble getting their boats in. People are like spending five hours trying to get their little cars to back up just perfectly into the ramp. And it's difficult to do. But at Long Pond, where Jacob's video was filmed last week, the ramp is like double what it usually is. Circus theme! Hannah would like me to tell you that if she were to be in the circus, she would be a tightrope walker. I thought a lot about what I would be in the circus, and I think I would be like the lady that sings things and like breaks glasses with her voice. Although Mr. Ryan always told me that that was a lot more difficult than people made it seem. I've always liked the circus. I once read this book called Water for Elephants, which is about this older man who is like reminiscing back on his days when he used to work for the circus. And it's a really good book. I recommend it for people to read, especially those of us who sit for six hours a day at boat landings. And I was really excited when Britney Spears like titled her whole album Circus. Britney Spears knows how I feel about life. <laughs> We should all go to the circus together. Let's start planning that, like, now so that it actually happens. So I was playing around with iTunes since iTunes is now a lot more relevant in my life, and I searched for Fusik and Entrance of the Gladiators, and I listened to a lot of, like, orchestral arrangements, but then I listened to this Lisa Harris version, and it was ballet dancer-esque and stuff. So I picked that one. But while I was, like, searching for different versions to make sure that a copyright issue wouldn't happen again because we all know how that goes with me and my videos. So you know how YouTube is now? How it shows the comments that have been liked the most? Well, there was one comment on it and I even liked it and I don't usually like things on YouTube because I think it's stealing from Facebook. But I liked this comment and I'll show it to you right now. There's really not a lot that's better than lame puns in my life. You guys should all watch Pokemon movies because they have a lot of lame puns in them, generally, via Team Rocket. Also, I finished Buffy. Also, Full Metal Alchemist has one episode left as of today, it being Tuesday and all. So it's not like I filmed this video before I watched the second to last episode of Full Metal Alchemist, but as of now I have watched it and there's no more excuses. Everyone on this channel needs to watch Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood, and people who aren't on this channel should watch it also. It's good. It's so good. And, it being Tuesday, Eclipse comes out tonight. Christina and I read Twilight when it first came out, and we really liked it. Like, I'm pretty sure I read Twilight in one night. And now that I am older and more learned, thanks to Mr. Brown and everyone else that has a brain, I know that... The series is problematic, but I still like it. Oh, it's so beautiful. The atmosphere. Honestly, though, Kristen Stewart is hideous. Can we all just admit that Kristen Stewart is not good looking? But that's why we have Rosalie and Jasper and Alice and Carly. But it is Tuesday, which means that tomorrow is Wednesday, which means you guys get to watch Kayla. And I've heard that she's had a lot of fun making this video, and I'm sure it'll be really literary and creative writing-y and UMF-influenced. So you'll see Kayla tomorrow. It's funny to me that the last person who wore this shirt wasn't even me. 